What President Trump just pointed out about the witch hunt will have Mueller's stomach in knots by US4Trump.com. President Trump was on a roll Thursday morning and came out slamming the swamp. The president is not afraid to call it like he sees it, and he's not afraid to trigger his haters and the mainstream media. President Trump took to Twitter Thursday morning, dropping one bomb after another, and he uh, gets his message directly to the people, uh, bypassing the mainstream media and fake news. The president slammed Mueller and his witch hunt, mocking him and the 13 angry Democrats who are conducting their phony investigation while the president is pressing on fixing America and creating peace in the world. President Trump then uh, went after the Democrats who are hiding their DNC server. He called out the Justice Department, urging them to not let Imran Awan and Debbie Wasserman Schultz off the hook. Next, the president took a jab at Comey. When will the people start saying, thank you, Mr. President, for firing James Comey? We can assume this was a jab at the mainstream media because we, the people, know that Comey is a liar, a leaker, and a crook. The president then slammed the Obama administration next, who is now accused of trying to give Iran secret access to the financial system. Uh, of the United States. You can read the full details there. Last, President Trump took a swipe at Jeff Flake, and it's absolutely hilarious. He called him a flake. Isn't it moronic getting ready to go to the G7 in Canada to fight for our country on trade? We have the worst trade deals ever made. Then off to Singapore to meet with North Korea and the nuclear problem. But but back home, we still have the 13 angry Democrats pushing the witch hunt. Alan Dershowitz, Harvard Law professor, uh, it all proves that we never needed a special counsel. All of this could have been done by the Justice Department. Don't need a multi-million dollar group of people with a target on someone's back. Not the way justice should operate. So true. When are uh, and where? Will all of the many conflicts of interest be listed by the 13 angry Democrats, plus working on the witch hunt hoax? Uh, there uh, has never been a group of people on a case so biased or conflicted. It is all uh, a Democrat excuse for losing the election. Where is the server? Our Justice Department must not let Awan and Debbie Wasserman Schultz off the hook. The Democrat IT scandal is a key to much of the corruption we see today. They want to make a plea deal to hide what is on their server. Where is server? Really bad. When will people start saying thank you, Mr. President, for firing Comey? I'll say it right now. Thank you. The Obama administration is now accused of trying to give Iran access, a secret access to the financial system of the United States. This is totally illegal. Perhaps we could get the 13 angry Democrats to divert some of their energy to this matter, as Comey would call it, investigate. <laughs> you gotta love them. How could Jeff Flake, who is setting uh, record low polling numbers in Arizona and was therefore humiliatingly forced out of his own Senate seat without even a fight and who doesn't have a clue. Think about running for office, even a lower one again. Let's face it, he's a flake. <laughs> Keep tweeting, Mr. President. Do you like how uh, President Trump takes to Twitter to get his message directly to the American people, bypassing the mainstream me media? Uh, yeah, absolutely. Absolutely. Yeah, because th the mainstream MSM is not going to get this word out if Trump wasn't uh, getting his message across. Absolutely. Absolutely. Let me know what you guys think in the comments below. And again, thank you so much for watching.